All right, we're going to move on to looking at intersections of geometric terms. First thing we have here are two lines. I've got line M, and I've also got line N. Now, notice this time I've described those two lines using the small subscript letters. Now, when we're talking about two lines and they intersect, they're always going to intersect at a specific point. Okay, so I'm going to call this point point A. And because it's a point, we use the capital letter A. So again, when we're looking at two lines and they intersect each other, they will always intersect each other at a specific point. All right, so as we just mentioned, if we have two lines that intersect each other, they uh, intersect each other at a specific point. But what if we have two planes that intersect each other? As you can see from my... Um, attempt here at drawing two planes. I've got this plane right here and I'm calling this plane right here plane B and that is a uh, capital uh, subscript uh, letter there and then we have my other plane that would be this one right here and I'm calling this plane right here A. Now where these two planes intersect they intersect right here and they intersect at a line. Now I'll call this point capital A and I'll call this point capital B. So these two planes intersect at this line that I'm calling line AB. So when we have two planes that intersect each other, they're always going to intersect each other at a line. All right, the last thing we're going to look at is what happens if we have a plane and a line. So what I've got drawn here is I've got a plane, and I'm calling this plane R. Remember, that's a capital subscript letter there. And then I've also got the line. That's this right here. Now, you've got to imagine that it's going through this plane here, and that's the line VQ. Now, these two, plane and the line, intersect each other right here at this specific point. So they intersect at point R. So whenever we have a plane and a line and they intersect each other, they're always going to intersect each other at a point. So these are the three scenarios we're going to come across. We have two lines that intersect. We say they intersect at a point. If we have two planes that intersect, they intersect at a line. And finally, if we have a plane and a line, they're always going to intersect each other at a specific point.